Hey y'all, everyone on YouTube. It's me, Jenny. Sorry, my foot is just. I have to get this pretty much off my chest, which my chest ain't big. But, um. <laughs> it's been brewing for over a year. Over a year. And. I waited till the right time to actually say this and actually say it on Facebook and actually do this on Facebook. One of my cousins I took a break from. I mean, I can't see her post, but I could. I don't know why they do this, but they send me her notifications. On whether she posts. Now. Let me backtrack a little bit. Let me tell you a little story. Everyone. I mean, Y'all know that my mom passed away. March the 12th of 2020. And. Um, the three days. Three days. She was there, nonstop, calling, asking, I mean, coming over to the house. I mean, actually, pretty much, supposed to be lending her services, but she ain't got none. Um, she did that for three days. And whenever we buried my mom... Nothing. You didn't hear nothing but crickets. Okay. Five weeks later. I'm in the hospital. I had my leg am amputated below the knee. On my right side. I post every. Every. Inch of my journey. Of where I'm at, if I'm at the prosthesis, or I'm at my primary care doctor, or I'm at my therapist, I post. I don't hear shit from her. Not a damn thing. The only time I hear from her, and I did this one time, and I only did it because of my grandmama. My grandmama didn't, didn't make me. But it was... Thanksgiving and I called my grandmama to wish her a happy Thanksgiving we've been invited to go to a neighbor's house for Thanksgiving because she treats us like family and I appreciate it now if I get a hold, hold of my cousin's husband which his ass is up the road too I, there's something I want to say to him too and I know daddy wants to say something to him too. But. Let me get back to my thoughts. The only time that I call, um, Whenever I called. She pick up, picked up the phone. I graciously. Talked to her for a little bit. Saying that I'm doing good. I'm walking. Oh that's good. That's good. You got to continue on doing it. Where in the fuck was that? Oh my Facebook status status where in the fuck was that family don't do that shit i know some of my cousins don't have my phone number and i'm really i hope she's seen my post because i don't give a fuck i hope it goes around But the last time she even had the nerve, now she done this before, had the nerve to put my name down for a fucking reference to a lone place in Orangeburg, which was right next to the pharmacy, which I'm not going to name any names. And, um, 
They called. My dad picks up the phone. It was about 8 o'clock in the morning. The child was already up, thank God. And I go and I tell him, I said, now look. I have not heard from her. I hadn't heard from her since my mom, since we buried my mom. That's been over a year ago. I said, sure, no problem. You know, we'll remove your name. I said, no, and by the way, I hadn't, I had, I wanted to ask, it, ask this. May I ask, what is this for? And he, he just told me, you know, since she does a lot of business with us, We wanted to contact her references. I said, but, okay, but I just want my name removed. And sure, no problem, we'll do that. Got a feeling she wants money. <laughs> oh, no, I'm, no, no, don't put my name down. Don't put my name down for shit. Okay, what was the name? Oh, yeah, and today, whenever I did the post. She, I mean, I'm all for vaccinations. Everyone knows that. I'm all for face mask and all that. I don't know if she wears a mask around grandmama, which my grandmama is 92 years old. And she spent Saturday and Sunday with her. And she's just getting her second dose of the Moderna vaccination. Um, sweetheart, you should not have been around grandmama until you are fully vaccinated. Fully. But, that's mama's side of the family. But I just, I put a post on there. I mean, I didn't name no names. I just put down, since it's, it's a shame. I was going to put down, it's a damn shame, but I took out the word damn I said it's a shame that it has been a year since me and my dad buried my mom and five and I had my amputation my leg amputation did I don't hear from mama's side of the family oh there, there's more than one I mean, I did contact one, and I did contact the other. No, I want him to hear this too, even though he did not, does not know my number or anything. You know, I do forgive. I mean, if you post down you don't have my number, I do forgive you. Look it up. But. I wanted to aim it to that one in particular. One. I had to block two. But I wanted the other one to take a break, but Facebook wouldn't let me do it. It let me block them. And the other one, he's out of state. He don't ask. I mean, he's got his own family. I forgive that, but I had to block him because Facebook wouldn't let me let, let him take a break. So I know who my real family is. It's the ones that call me. It's the ones that post on my page how I'm doing. And it's just pretty messed up. It's bad enough that you have family. So I got this pimple already. What the fuck? I'm going like a damn tree. It's just it's just not right. It's not right at all. Family should not do family like that. Let it be water up under the bridge. But I've had enough. She even did this when my mama was alive. Mm -hmm. So if anything happens to my grandmama. And like I said, I can't go down there. My dad can't take me because 
he's taking the shingles vaccinations and he's not vaccinated for COVID because he's taking the shingles shingles vaccinations. They have to wait in, be, in between. But he wants to get vaccinated. And he does take extra precautions because he does not want it to be passed to me. He does carry his mask all the time. I do too. I carry it in my backpack so I don't forget and then I'll put it on. Well, that is it for right now. <laughs> Uh, I just had to get this off my chest to explain. Now, I am on Facebook. Follow me on Facebook. The links will be, my names will be down below on my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Which I don't think none of my relatives is on Instagram on or Twitter. I hope they do. But thank y'all for watching. Thank y'all for listening. See y'all later. Bye.